So the efficacy is around 93.5% or something like that, which means that if you get it, you have a pretty good chance of not getting the virus, right? That's right. But now the Delta variant has come along, and presumably there are going to be other variants. Is uh, the Moderna vaccine going to be working against that, or do you have a, something just for the Delta variant? We are, as technology developers, preparing for any eventuality, including looking at what our baseline vaccine after two doses does, which so far, six months, data we have available is very, very robust. We haven't seen any real deterioration of our protection. That's first. Against the Delta virus, we have very strong protection, and we expect that will continue for a period of time. The problem is we don't know for how long, because you find out when your guard is down after your guard is down. So in order to prepare for that eventuality, we have begun to make variant vaccines, vaccines that have different sequences that, if needed, we could accelerate so that we can actually use that. So I think we're going to work very closely with regulators, FDA, CDC here, and, and the Europeans, to figure out from an arsenal of... The beauty about the mRNA technology is that we can actually do this type of rapid response versus conventional biotechnology that takes years and years to do the same thing. Well, to get to the heart of the problem, my own personal situation, so I got two uh, Moderna shots. Do I need a booster shot? I think that the best advice so far is that people... Uh, after a certain age, and I cannot tell you right now what that age cutoff will be because that will be set by the government, are most likely going to need a booster to be well protected against the variant. And over time, again, public health officials are going to have to decide if everybody should get a booster shot. My guess is that given enough time, we may well end up in a situation where we have yearly, let's say at a minimum yearly vaccinations, just like the flu. So Tony Fauci has said that we should use this example of what happened with the coronavirus to prepare for other potential viruses down the road and that hopes companies like yours will do that. Are you working on that kind of thing in now already? Or? Uh, absolutely, absolutely. A very big part of Moderna's future will be in being the leading vaccine developer but also with mRNA technology, but also additional new technologies that we're considering to augment our capability. But I should also say that within the broader flagship pioneering context, which is where I operate, we have multiple projects as well looking to expand the security net for future pandemics. 